With a target on their backs, Standish Drilling Softball has begun their defense of its Division Three state championship. But as they are learning, it's never easy to repeat, especially with injuries affecting the team to begin this season, forcing the girls to adapt. We all had a switch position, so we have just kind of done our fundamentals and had to work, keep working with that and played in the game to see how it goes out. And it's been doing pretty good. So hopefully once everyone's back, we'll be, our team will be fully back. I think we've learned that to be ready for anything because a lot of people have been out of position and just kind of like learn from the opportunities that we've been like given and like take, let the classmen have the opportunity to step up and like take advantage of this opportunity. Due to the injuries, a young Panthers team has been relying on their freshmen as the upperclassmen continue to help them develop. I think as long as we keep the encouragement and like just keep helping, I mean as a freshman it's hard, like you're nervous, it's hard just coming onto a varsity team, but I think as long as we keep the encouragement going, we should, everyone should be good. And for these young players, the experience they are getting now could be the key to the Drilling making another run in the playoffs. I think it's great to have it right now um, because, I mean let's face it, it's uh, it doesn't really matter if you win or lose right now. Um, you know, come May 31st, the uh, first day of districts, that's when it's most important. Um, so now, whether we have starters or, or returning players back or not, we're going to have people ready to play in all those positions. In Standish, Cole Martins, WNEM TV5 Sports.